Hello, America. Rodney Carr again, your favorite underqualified candidate for president. This is my second video of the morning, which doesn't normally happen, but I do have one more thing on my mind that I need to get out, um, and that's talking about social constructs, which I do agree we should be pushing against social constructs. Before I get too much farther into it, remember, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, follow the channel, depending on what platform you're watching on. I will be turning this into a short, but it's also going to be a longer video, so if you catch it in a short, please check out the whole video. We've been pushing against the idea of gender as a social construct, but that's actual biology. One set of people produces sperm, one set of people produces eggs. That's actual biology. But there is a social construct that we are not recognizing as a social construct. And I believe as a nation we would be better served if we actually pushed against that. And that thing is race. Race is a social construct. Let's take Asians for example, when we think of Asians, we're actually talking about people from the Orient. But the country of India is also in Asia, but we don't call them Asian. And the big majority of Russia is also in Asia. But they're Caucasian looking just like me. But we don't call them Asian. There's also white people in Africa. And if they move over here, they're not called African Americans. So really race is, for some reason, divi divided between black and white. If you're not black, you get lumped into white. Why are we taking away from these people? They have their own nationality. They have their own race. They have their own ideals. So race is literally a social construct, but yet, we allow it to divide us. And then we call something that's actually biology, we call that a social construct. I, I don't know where we're getting this from and why as a nation we allow this to perpetuate a divide in between us. We could drop the whole idea of race in general. Every country would technically be their own race. But yet, we don't look at it that way. We look at it in color. And that's not correct at all. So, I just ask that our nation start thinking again and stop believing everything we hear and really look into our beliefs before we move forward and fight with each other. I really believe that disagreements are only opportunities to learn, not reasons to hate. Anyways, if any of that sounds good, remember, Rodney Carr and the writing spot on your ballot. Thank you.